Despite their small share of the global prison population, around 700,000 over the past decade, the number of women and girls being held in penal institutions around the world has increased significantly and at a faster rate than men. Regardless of age, nationality or faith, these female prisoners often share common backgrounds which shape their pathways to prison. Many have similar histories of abuse and trauma, substance abuse, mental and physical health problems and limited opportunities for access to education and work. Without appropriate support and gender-sensitive treatment, female prisoners are at risk of re-victimization in the prison setting and subsequent re-offending. Having been from the very start supporting the United Nations rules for the treatment of women prisoners and non-custodial measures for women offenders, also known as the Bangkok Rules, the Thailand Institute of Justice has been accumulating and sharing in-depth experience and valuable know-how from experts in this field with correctional officials around the world. Women used to be a very small amount uh, compared to the large amount of prisoners who are mostly male. Um, so in the prison setting, um, the design, the procedure in the prisons, the attitude of the prison officers, mostly they are quite used to male prisoners. So when it comes to female prisoner, uh, the lack of understanding, the lack of the mindset to understand the gender perspective is very important. Uh, so this course has been designed to put gender perspective into the culture of prison. And um, this is the first time that we have this training course of the Bangkok Rule. This 10-day training on the management of women prisoners for correctional staff will see a number of world-class experts in this field share with participants their knowledge and lifelong experience in line with the Bangkok Rules. Our training program implementing the Bangkok Rules in the ASEAN region is the next step in the very important work done by the Thailand Institute of Justice. Prior to the establishment of TIJ, the Kingdom of Thailand was instrumental in bringing worldwide attention to the plight of women offenders and bringing their issues on a worldwide stage. In implementing the Bangkok rules, TIJ is supporting the next step to training senior prison managers about the context and reasons for the rules, pushing participants to think about how they can implement and sustain these rules once they go home. Through the lecture sessions, group workshops and on-site field trips to correctional facilities, those taking part will gain a true understanding of the significance of the international standards and norms in the treatment of women prisoners, engage in information sharing, about managing women's prisons, be capable of self-assessing their own institutions as to whether they comply with UN standards, as well as generating action plans for increasing compliance with the Bangkok rules and other international standards. The 10-day training by TIJ has already proven successful for previous international participants. <laughs> ก็เป็นการลงลึกในรายละเอียดที่คํานึงถึงความละเอียดอ่อนทางเพศและก็ความรู้ทางด้านสิทธิมนุษยชนเราอาจจะเคยชินกับผู้ต้องขังจนทําให้เราเนี่ยลืมสัมผัสถึงอารมณ์ของเขาแล้วก็ความละเอียดอ่อนของเขาว่าความรู้สึกแรกที่เขาเข้ามาในเรือนจำเนี่ยเขาจะรู้สึกกังวลถึงอนาคตของเขายังไง So they put together really really um, easy to understand context and I'm sure when I go back and uh, use those guidelines in my work, it will serve like a, an SOP procedure and protocol where we can focus on and base on so that uh, our uh, practice can be in conformity with the UN's guidelines. So we have staff, personnel, policymakers from different ASEAN countries coming together 
sharing their challenges, sharing their practices and their best practices. So where we might have one person saying, well, this is a real challenge I've been facing, another one might say, well, yeah, we faced that too and this is how we approached it. And then around all of this, you have the guidelines from the Bangkok rules. So I think that sharing and learning process and the discussion in particular and the critical thinking has been incredibly transformative. Join us in implementing an international standard in your prison service to create a rights-based correctional system for women prisoners worldwide.